lawyer says we're not supposed to talk. Did you tell him that the only reason you're doing all of this is so that you and I will talk? Now, he is my son, too. As I carried him, I gave birth to him. And you him. couldn't sign those papers to get him away fast enough, Eva. This isn't about Benny. It's about you finding a way to get back with me. What's wrong with that? I mean, we could give him a better family. Me and you together. He has a family. Now, I know that Diesel is the reason that you stayed with her all these years. Her name is Karen. And I love her. She's got you trapped living this sad suburban life that it's not you. But when I get custody... Now, you know that's never going to happen. So tell me. What do we have to do to make you stop this insanity? What, you need money? We don't got a lot, but, but what? That's what it's going to take. I want you. You had me, Eva. You had me. I loved you. I would have done anything for you. That wasn't enough. I wasn't enough. See, you have this fantasy of us playing house as if I hadn't already lived through that. I know how it goes. I know how it goes. It's me trying over and over and over to build a life for us and you tearing it down brick by brick by brick until I'm left alone, heartbroken in a hole that I don't even know how to climb out of. I survived you, Eva. And I'm sure as hell not gonna let you put Denny through this. Wait. Just wait. Okay, it won't be like that this time. Being in that cage has changed me. I love you. I love you. You are incapable of caring about anybody but yourself, which is why I will never let you near my son. Count on that. Count on it. <laughs>